in this heat. Christine Oharugu, Great Britain's former Olympic and world champion. One has to say, even though she's not quite at the same level as she was when she was winning those global titles, she's a class apart from the rest of the women in this field. Yes, if she can show her normal form. And of course, she's a redoubtable big championship competitor, no doubt about that. But she had to withdraw from the British trials because of illness just beforehand. So she hasn't achieved much yet this year. No, as you say, but uh, a redoubtable big time competitor. She does seem to always get it. Britain and Northern Ireland, Orquesa, Spain. Lassiseva Kudari from Latvia. Chigbolo, Italy. And out in lane eight. Kutalova from Slovakia. Okay. At this stage, Chigbolu running well over the first hundred meters. I know Haruga has gone off quicker than usual, Phil. Yes, indeed, that's also very true. She's making up a lot of ground on Bocessa on her outside, and the Spaniard herself is a very good runner. And now Haruga, yeah, it's very quick 200 metres from Great Britain's former Olympic and world champion. Now Haruga is running extremely well. 150 metres to go, and it's Haruga and Chigbolu, clearly the one and two at this stage, as we see the bend. Unfold Oharuga now a meter or two in front of Chigbalu. Chigbalu look, just looking as though she's struggling a little bit over these final 50 meters. Oharuga though clearly the winner there, coming through like Saber Kudare having a good run, and that possibly is even a personal best from the Latvian who was running in lane six there. So the Latvian comes through very strongly over the final 50 meters to overtake Chigbalu, but no doubt at all about the winner there, and. Running very comfortably in my estimation, Christine Oharugu, 52-69. Yes, a good start, and she ran it hard going off hard earlier. She'll need to run a fair bit quicker than that if she's even to get selection, of course, for the British team for Rio, because two have already qualified from the trials. Just looking here at a replay of the race there, yes. This is a coming up to the 200 meter mark where she just tucks inside Bokessa. Now down the home straight, you can see here Chigbalu starting to wander all over the place in her lane. She actually went out of her lane there, but didn't impede the Latvian on her inside. But I think a good morning's work there from Oharugu, just what she needed. Yep. Morkessa possibly came through. for that third automatic qualifying spot. We'll confirm that in a moment. As the wheels came off a little bit on a Chigbolu. Novozelova of Ukraine in the second round of 